Okay, so today we're going to do a demonstration of how to assemble and disassemble our local anaesthetic materials. So we have our forceps, our local anaesthetic syringe, our actual local anaesthetic carpule and our needle. Um, before we start, we need to make sure that we have the correct type of anaesthetic that we want to use and we also need to make sure that we check the use by date. And also need to check that we have the right needle, whether it be long or short. So we take our syringe, sort of pull back the ring and open the back of the syringe. That's where we're going to place our cartridge in like so. We're going to close that up and we're going to screw it in tight until we feel that the back of that syringe is engaged with the rubber stopper there. We can then apply our needle. So just remove the back of that needle like so. And then we very gently insert that and make sure that it's screwed on tightly. And there we go. There is our local anaesthetic solution ready to administer to a patient. Now when we go to use it with our patient, we need to use our forceps to remove the lid. Uh, we never use our fingers to remove the lid. So very carefully we place the forceps over, give it a little jiggle, and that will remove it ready for us to use the local anaesthetic on our patient. Now when we go to dispose of the needle and the cartridge, uh, here at the Royal Dental Hospital of Melbourne, we don't recap our needles. We dispose of them immediately after use. So we place it very carefully over the sharps container and use our forceps to unscrew the needle, like so. Give it a bit of a jiggle and then we dispose of our cartridge straight away as well, like so.